What's going up guys, it is me your honor subscribe back to you with a brand new video Today we're gonna have the tutorial finally on the breadwinners The breadwinners is one of my favorite builds of all time like all of the cartoon builds that I made Since the beginning of the channel, this is my favorite And actually the house is my favorite You, you can say it's debatable on the rocket van but this is how it looks like guys, if, if you do enjoy this video, I don't normally say this, but if you do like this tutorial or this house, please leave a like, and uh, this is how this is gonna go, first of, this first part we're gonna be building this base, the second part will be the tube and the pl platform, part 3 is gonna be the, the main house that they live in, and this is gonna be like a separate tutorial. So yeah, it's gonna be three parts, and this is gonna be a separate tutorial. So guys, without further ado, let's get into our blocks. Okay guys, so for blocks you'll need is some cyan concrete, smooth sandstone, packed ice, red concrete, lime concrete, block of quartz, quartz slab, and a birch slab planks. And this is what you're gonna need for now guys, so before I start at any point of the video that I think I'm going a little bit too fast, you can always feel free to pause the video or rewind. Without further ado, let's get into this. You wanna start out with your cyan concrete by adding 5 on the ground, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it should look like this. And then leave a spacing of 5 to the right of it, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And on the 6th one, add a cyan. To the right of that cyan, go to the right by 4, so 1, 2, 3, 4, it should look like this, pause the video if you need to, go back to the left, do 2 cyan, 2 red, 1 cyan, go all the way to the right, do 1 cyan, 1 packed ice, 1 cyan, 1 packed ice, one cyan go all the way to the right to the left I'm sorry do two cyan two red one cyan go all the way to the right do one cyan one ice one cyan one ice one cyan when I'm saying ice guys it's mean packed ice so pause the video if you need to go all the way to the left do 5, cyan, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, leave a spacing of 5, then go back here, do 3 cyan, 1 ice, 1 cyan, it should look like this, then go back to the left, 1 cyan, 1 lime, and then 2 cyan, it should look like this, Leave a space, and then just go all the way to the right, back here. And then you want to do, starting on this right block, you want to add 4, going to the left. It should look like this. Go all the way back to the left. Starting on top of this cyan. Place one cyan, and then go all the way to the right. I'll back up for you guys to see it should look like this. This is how it should look like. And then add a row of quartz on top of that. So add one more row of quartz on top of it. It should look like this. And then have one row of cyan on top of it. I'll back up. You can pause the video right now if you need to. And then we're gonna start shaping up the roof from here. So starting on top of this block on the left, do two rows of uh, block of quartz. Back up for you guys to see. It should look like this. Go back to the left. You want to skip this first block. Go all the way to the right until you're missing one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It should be thirteen if you want to count it out. Add one more row on top of it. I'll back up for you guys to see. It should look like this. And then what, all you want to do is skip this first block on the left. You want to go to the right by 11, starting on top of the second block. So starting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 
back up for you guys to see it should look like this and the, now really really fast what you want to do this you where you have this red concrete extend it outwards by one the same thing with your lime so add it, extend it out by one and if you want to grab yourself an item frame let's get, uh, get rid of the swiftness do you see where I have these three pack ties going up? You can go all the way up like there's gonna be a block on top of those three. Go up by one. Do two iron frames. Place lime tear concrete in it. Place torches uh, on the wall. Okay, nice. So it should look like this. And that's pretty much it for the front. And if you want to do this with your smooth sandstone one row behind, where you have this like bread shape, you want to fill in from the back. So I'll show you, where, I'll go to the front and you should see how it should look like. Let's fly all the way up, go back here. As you can see, it should be one row behind. So that's pretty much the front. And now all I want to do is get my plants for the sides and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so now we're on we are on the right side of the main structure of the house and real quick let's go back to the front where we have these two torches break them and you should just you should you should just have these lime so that's what you want let's go to the right side starting from this block you want to go to the right by 12 so one two, with your sign concrete go back by 12 so one two three four five six 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. It should look like this. And then with your birch, you want to do three birch. One, two, three. One cyan. It should look like this. Add one more row on top of it. Okay. It should look like this. Go all the way to the left. Go to the right by 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then do one packed ice, actually add one more, add one more so it should be 10, and then add one packed ice, one cyan, one birch, one packed ice, one birch, one cyan, back up for it should look like this, go back to the left, Go to the right by 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1 packed ice, 1 cyan, 3 birch, 1 cyan, should look like this, and then just add one row on top of that with your cyan, it should look like this, you wanna go all the way to the left, you want to add, let's see, you want to add one cyan, go to the right by 9 with your packed ice, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Actually, you want to go back by, let's see, 10, 11, 12. You want to go all the way back by 12, so go back by 12, and then add 3 cyan, so it should be 3 cyan at the end. And then add a row of block of quartz on top of it. It should be aligned with your quartz in the front. It should look like this. And then add one row of block of cyan concrete. Okay. And then you can do your two rows of block of quartz. I'm just filling out my block of quartz real quick. And it should look like this. You just want to add those two rows on top of it. And now guys, all I, all I need is for this side. And I'll be right back when I have the plants. Because I'm really confused on this side. So I'll be right back. Okay guys, so now we are on the left side of the breadwinner's like main building. I don't know why I activated the elytra. But you want to be on the left, left side of the breadwinner's. Starting from this block right here, you want to add 16 going back with your cyan concrete from this block, from the front block. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh my god, it should look like this. 
and then add 3 rows on top of it with your scion concrete for it to end up as 4 rows of scion concrete. So this is 2, 3. I'll back up for you guys to see. It should look like this. Now let's go back to left real quick. You want to do 2 cyan. And go all the way to the right with your pack ties until you one block. And then on that last block add a cyan. So it should be 2 blocks of cyan on each end. Copy that row one more time. Okay. Go back here. Let's see how it should look like. It should look like this. And then don't forget to add your row of block of quartz. And your row of cyan on top of it. Back up for you guys to see. It should look like this. And then add your two rows of block of quartz. One and two. This is the back side, right, left side. I'm sorry of your, of the breadwinner's building, and on the back, all you want to do is connect these to each other on the, from like it should be 50, 13 blocks in the middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twelve, eleven, twelve, twelve, wait. So it's just gonna connect them. I, I I think I said twelve, eleven, twelve. <laughs> So it should be 13, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It should be 13. And then add four, 5 rows on top of it with your cyan concrete. So this is 1, 2. I shouldn't, I, I really should, shouldn't be counting this out because it'll just annoy you. So finally let's add my 5th row. I'll back up for you guys to see it should look like this. Now with your block of quartz at a row connecting to the other side. It should look like this. And then add a row of block of quartz. Not a block of quartz but of cyan concrete. It should look like this. Finally add two rows back here with your, si with your block of quartz. Back up for you guys to see it should look like this. And now just to make it easier on ourselves, on ourselves, you want to skip this first block on the left. So it should be on the second one. Add 13 going to the right with the block of course starting on top of this uh, second block on the left. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It should look like this. Pause the video if you need to. Add one more row on top of it. With your block of quartz, it should look like this. To end this off, you want to skip this first block on the left, should be on the second one. Starting on top of this second block, you want to go to the right by 11. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And it should look like this, guys. And now, how you want to fill in the roof, like, let's go to the front. So on the front, starting to the left side, where you have like this block of quartz, add them like coming out. Like I'll pause, you can pause the video if you need to, because it's really weird how to explain this, but I'll do it and then you guys should figure it out. Hopefully you do. Okay, now that's the wrong place. So it should look like this. So all we did is we added like blood coming out. And then you want to go let pause the video like when I'm doing this. So we want to start out right here. We want to add these like coming out from the sides. And pretty much that's what you want to that's what you're going to want to do going all the way. This this should be easy if you're following this correctly. Or if you're like slowing down the video. So this is the back. And now all you want to do is like connect these to each other like like this. So I'll just show you. Finally it should look like this. And then connect these to each other. And I'll be right back when I'm done with that. Okay guys so after you're done filming it in it should look like this. 
So now that's really the main part of the house done, but I forgot to add like one small detail. You want to go to the right to the right side of the house where you have like this birch door. Starting from here like from one block diagonal to the right from that packed ice, add a, uh, a stone button. And then grab yourself, just if you want to do this, grab yourself a birch door and place it like in the middle right here. You can barely see it, but that's a way that you can get in. I'll slap myself with a night vision real quick. As you, there, as you can see, there's gonna be a lot of room, and like when we're when we'll do the tube, there's gonna be like a block coming all the way up and then going all the way up to that tube. So that's really it. And now all we want to do add is that like extension thing that they have. So for that, you're gonna need yourself a block of quartz, quartz slab, and a quartz stair. And where you want to start this, do you see we have these like two, two, one? You want to sit, start on that second one. So that second set of two, so right here. You want to go from the right, going to the right, you want to skip one block. Actually, I want to skip two blocks. So one, two. You should be on this third one. Actually, I want, okay, let's just double check. The, let's go slow on this one. So, you want to start on that second part, set of two. Skip this first block. You should be on this second one. On this second one, add an upside down stair. Okay. And then, in front of that stair, you want to add, let's see, a block of quartz and we're going to in front of it. It should look like this. And now on the bottom half, add a block of quartz. A slab. Of slab quartz underneath that slab add a, uh, a block underneath that block add a slab and to the left side of that block of, of that slab add a block of quartz on top of that block of quartz add a quartz slab pause the video right now because I know that was confusing and we're gonna have to do that five more times so you want to go back to the right of that stair you want to skip four blocks, so one, two, three, four. And on the fifth one, add an upside down stair. Leave a spacing of four to the right, so one, two, three, four. And on the fifth one, add an upside down stair. Copy the exact same thing, so a block, a slab, a block, slab, slab, block. Boom, I'm done with one. And it's really easy, like... Uh, uh, this is I don't know how I made this shape, but I did So it should look like this That's the front side and you want to go back go to the back do the exact same thing So I'm just gonna do this real quick. I Don't even need my plans for this. So let's add a slap Where I want to place Okay Nice that's one boom Boom, 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 boom. That's two. Finalists add this fin final one. Uh, okay. And that's the tutorial done, guys. Let, if, if you want to fill in the, the, like the, what is it called? The interior. This is what I'll do for an interior. I'll just do this real quick. I won't be filling it in, but I'll show you if you want to fill it in. It should, it should be like... If I'm going to fill it in, that's how I'm go I am going to fill it in. So, if you want to follow that exact same thing that I'm following it in, you can be my guest. So... So, I just broke out the perimeter of the house from the interior. From the inside, not from the interior. Okay. And I don't know why I'm filling in the interior because of, there's gonna be like more interior. So pause the video right now if you need to. And then replace all the scratches with oak. I'll do that because I don't know why I did this. But since I'm already done the house. So you wanna break all the, all the grass fill in with oak. And I'll be right back when I'm done. So guys after you're done filling it in it should look like this. And if you're wondering why did I choose this block palette because it sort of looks like bread, like toast. 
like the the edges are burnt in the middle like that beautiful buttery so that's how it should look like on the inside guys and this is the main part of the breadwinner's house complete there's a lot more details so the next part this is part one part two is gonna be that tube and that platform part three is gonna be the house the rocket band is gonna be a separate tutorial so guys if you did enjoy this video don't forget to leave a like subscribe and comment what we'd love to see me do next it's been me Ronasis Craft Peace.